seems very appropriate for this type of video, don't you think? Hey guys, I'm Jack from Phantasm and Paranormal. I wanted to just talk to you very quickly, just because I don't want to talk ramble for too long, because I just want to show you uh, the session. I want to show you past ones as well, which I've done relating to this. If you don't want to listen to me uh, talk for a little bit, then you could just skip ahead to the time slides, which are in the description down below, if you don't want to listen to me talk, which is fine. But I encourage that you do, just to give you guys a little bit of context as to you know what this is kind of all about. So you guys know I'm quite an avid believer that there has to be other intelligent life out there in the universe. Considering how vast the universe is, how vast space is, new planets being discovered every so often, new solar systems and such, and even new animals here on Earth. There's, I think there's a discovery of a new animal every six weeks on average, I believe. But when it comes to aliens, I do firmly believe there has to be some other form of intelligent life out there, mostly because of how, like I said, how vast space is. That saying there is no other life out there in the universe at all is like me putting a bucket putting a bucket into the ocean pulling the bucket up saying there's no life in the ocean because there's no life in my bucket it's pretty much impossible think about big the ocean is then apply that to space i have spoken about these things when it comes to ets aliens i've done a few sessions you know asking questions on that sort of stuff and i've even done a video where i explored the experience which i had of maybe seeing a ufo i say maybe because i can't truly be sure but i didn't see on my own my uh, late dad saw the same thing so he had the same experience i did that was the very first and only experience i have ever had and i describe you know what this thing looked like was it a spacecraft i don't know but it was just i go through my whole experience in that video so if you want to know a bit more about that experience then please do check it out it'll be in the description down below but i wanted to show you a few things i want to show you the sessions uh first so without further ado i'm just going to show you the previous one some previous ones which i did and then i'll jump back in in a little bit with some more context if there's other dimensions do you guys exist in another dimension Yeah! Oh wow, thank you. You exist in another dimension. Do you call it heaven or do you call it something else? Do you, um, kind of exist in another, in another dimension that maybe, uh... Is heaven even real, or do you just go to this dimension? Yeah. Yeah? Sorry, I asked a double-ended en double question, really. If all energy is pretty much free-flowing, are you able to travel to space, to the stars, or other planets? Can you travel to other planets if you so wished? Planet? No? Yeah, have any spirits ever gone to space? Have you been to the moon? Can you tell me, have you been to the moon? Yeah? What have you seen? Are the abduction stories true? By aliens? Yeah? yeah. Are aliens evolved humans from the future? <laughs> you mentioned about UFOs before.
Is there other intelligent life out there in the universe? intelligent life is out there in the universe do they breed with humans allegedly do they breed with humans with the women so is there other life forms is there other life forms out there that may be trying to Create human alien hybrids out there. Are they trying to reproduce? Are they trying to re Are they trying to reproduce with humans? To, to create like a hybrid creature, a hybrid intelligent life form with a mixture of human and Wherever they are, aliens. Do alien abductions happen? Have people been experimented on by ETs? Yes. Bit of a random question, but are there, are there any alien spacecrafts, UFOs above me right now? I know it's a random question. As I've said many times in the past, we cannot prove who or what we are speaking to. Could this be contact from aliens? Possibly. Could it be just dead people talking? Possibly. Could it be energy itself talking? Possibly. But the problem is, there's no way to verify this because we don't know who or what spirits are exactly. They've not been scientifically proven to be dead people. Um, but then again, I've spoken about the possibility that they could be beings from a parallel universe, could be indeed aliens, could be dead people, or maybe there is not just one example of what spirits actually are. They could be an amalgamation that could be what's to say that all these things are true and spirits are not just one particular uh, sort of entity they could be many things such as what I've just described but a lot of the times there comes a lot of cryptic messages a lot of it's just cryptic messaging most of the time you don't know what it means and it's very hard to find out what it means but do spirits give information and answer directly yes does it happen every single time no uh, do you get contact every single time no you don't and you know communication doesn't happen 100% of the time it just doesn't but when it happens it happens can you speak through this Are you aware of my presence? How many spirits are here? One. Are you man or woman? How many spirits are here again? One. Come from, are you a dead person? Did you used to live like me but died? Are you an alien? What solar system are you from? What planet are you from?
What planet are you from? Do you come from space? Do you, did you come from the sky? How are you doing this? Last sessions, which there was a few, there's an example which I wanted to show you from the manual scan uh, which I was using compared to an older session which I did. And when it talked about the star or stars, and when I was asking about um, if there was an alien spacecraft above me in an older session, and then I asked how they were communicating with me, and does it link? I don't know, but I wanted to show you it anyway, just so you can decide for yourself. Does this link or not? Does it mean anything at all? Maybe it doesn't. Maybe it does. Maybe it is related to uh, extraterrestrials. Who knows? But I want to show you that example. I mean, question, but are there, are there any alien spacecrafts, UFOs above me right now? I know it's a random question. doing this so does this relate at all let me know down in the comments tell me what you think because I'm not sure and there was another one which I you saw in the previous video about um, when it, ca it came to me asking questions about alien human hybrids is it possible that these alien abductions do happen. People like Travis Walton, these guys are telling the truth. Do people really get abducted by ETs? Well, there's very little evidence in the way to say that yes, they do, because we've only got really eyewitness testimony. We've only got their stories to go off of. So there's not much in the way of physical proof that they do definitely get abducted, apart from their stories. But when it comes to alien abductions, some people theorize that they're trying to create alien human hybrids. Who's to say that they are? Don't know if that's truly happening but when it comes to that sort of subject I did ask about that in uh, the older session like you saw and then in last night's session I was asking the questions again but also there was a few random uh, sort of replies which came out uh, but mind you do these things relate or not who knows if they interlink maybe they do maybe they don't but I just found it really interesting when I was asking those questions about do aliens reproduce with humans that get abducted? You know, specifically women, because they mentioned that in these sessions. So I want to show you these things. Do they link or not? I'm afraid you have to decide for yourself because there's no real way to know. But I want to show you that anyway. Other intelligent life that's out there in the universe. Do they breed with humans? Allegedly. Do they breed with humans? With the women? Are spirits talking about the exact same thing? Are they, am I communicating with some other intelligent life? Who knows? I'm afraid there's no true way to find out, but I think it's just interesting anyway. So I want to show you the most recent session which I did last night and just let you guys decide for yourself. Do these things interlink or not? Who knows? But I'm going to show you this anyway and I'll just say to you guys, take care. Let me know what you think down in the comments and let's have a chat. I'll see you soon. Okay, so the Jensen going here. Do you know of aliens? ETs? Young, young, young.
Have I ever communicated with aliens before? Hey! Can aliens speak to us? Have I spoke to any aliens recently? Other intelligent life? Yeah. Are you from this planet? Are you from my planet? So, so. When I was a teenager, did I see a UFO with my dad? Was that a UFO I saw with my dad when I was a teenager? Yes. Wow, okay. There was a long cigar shaped object with colourful lights on the side of it in like a ring. Do people get abducted by aliens? Are people being abducted by other life forms in their ships? Like Travis, like Travis Walton. I was Travis Walton, abduct, abducted by aliens, by other life. <laughs> was Travis Walton abducted in 1970? Oh. I've, 